Hi, I'm Penny Wheeler here with uh, Dr. Eric Barth. Eric, it's great to have you with me today. Thank you for being here. You're welcome. We've got a little bit of a problem, Eric. We've got an unprecedented measles outbreak uh, in our community, at least unprecedented of, of late. And we have uh, thousands of employees whose immunity we haven't been able to document. Um, we want to reach out to those employees and make sure that that gets done. Can you say, though, why, why is that so important? Well, as I'm sure all of our employees would agree, it's important that we protect our patients, especially the most vulnerable of our patients. So the patients who might be too young to get the measles vaccine, the MMR vaccine, usually we start giving that at 12 months of age, uh, or patients who are for medical reasons, unable to get the measles vaccine. Perhaps they've got uh, a compromised immune system and they're not allowed to get the, the MMR vaccine. So it can't assume that everybody is even able to get the vaccine and all the more reason that we need to not only protect the patients, protect ourselves too That's right. in this. That's right. right. So we're pr protecting our patients, protecting other employees, our coworkers, and then their families. Uh, so it's sort of an ever-widening circle, uh, and it's uh, a circle of protection that we can provide by uh, showing that we, we do have immunity. And I know it's, it's a bit of an inconvenience for folks. Uh, I've heard it talked about it at, uh, at my clinic. A little bit of grumbling that they have to go get a, a titer to show that they're immune to measles, but it's really for a, a good cause. Yeah. It's really part of our commitment to care for each other and, and for the patients we serve. That's exactly right. There's some of us who are old enough, uh, Eric, where we remember the measles. And we think, well, why is it a big deal? For many children, for many uh, people, it's a, uh, an innocent uh, childhood rite of passage almost. But, but measles is extremely contagious, uh, many times more contagious even than something like uh, influenza. And it can cause serious complications like measles encephalitis, uh, and it can cause uh, uh, deaths, uh, of course, hospitalizations. One of the greatest uh, medical advancements of the last hundred years are our immunizations. Uh, and in some ways, we're a victim of our own success because immunizations have been so successful that uh, parents and and patients don't realize the, the, the severity. They haven't seen the illnesses that, that you and I ha have seen in our, our years of practice. So although some of us has known it to have a relatively benign and time-limited course, it can cause really serious complications, especially for those most vulnerable. Uh, so it's really important to make sure we have documented immunity status for all our employees. That's right. That's okay. the right thing to do. Right. I can't thank you enough, uh, Dr. Barth, for coming in and talking about a really important issue. We want to, again, compel um, those employees who haven't had documented immunity, who have in your email inbox, uh, you know, a note that you need to do so. It's really important, again, for the protection of you, for the protection of those we serve. So thank you very much, Eric. I appreciate your time with us today. Thank you for having me.